accuracy and precision. They mean slightly different things. Accuracy is how close a measured value is to the actual, true, value. Precision is how close the measured values are to each other. Examples of accuracy and precision. High accuracy, low precision. Low accuracy, high precision. High accuracy, high precision. If you are playing football and you always hit the left goal post instead of scoring, then you are not accurate, but you are precise. How to remember. Accurate is correct, a bullseye. Precise is repeating, hitting the same spot, but maybe not the correct spot. Bias. Don't let precision fool you. When we measure something several times and all values are close, they may all be wrong if there is a bias. Bias is a systematic, built-in, error, which makes all measurements wrong by a certain amount. Examples of bias. The scales read 1 kilogram when there is nothing on them. You always measure your height wearing shoes with thick soles. A stopwatch that takes half a second to stop when clicked. In each case the measurements are wrong by the same amount. That is bias. Degree of accuracy. Accuracy depends on the instrument we are measuring with. But as a general rule, the degree of accuracy is half a unit each side of the unit of measure. When an instrument measures in ones, any value between 6.5 and, and 7.5 and is measured as 7. When an instrument measures in twos, any value between 7 and 9 is measured as 8. Notice that the arrow points to the same spot in each case, but the measured values are different. We should show final values that match the accuracy of our least accurate value used. Example, we are told the dog is about 2 feet high. We can convert that to 609.6 millimeters, but that suggests we know the height to within 0.1 millimeters. So we should use 600 millimeters.